What's up? It's three to we are here with portal two um, uh, I've been putting this game off a little bit as of today at the day of recording this you're probably seeing the first episode um, Of this game coming out. I've been doing a lot of half-life 2 so I figure It's about time to get back into portal 2 now. I think we ended off last episode on the fourth test chamber um, we were just told that science, uh, had proven that, uh, my parents didn't love me or whatever. Actually, what I'm going to do here real quick is, oh, okay. So, yeah. So, if I remember right, GLaDOS said that, uh, she could scientifically prove, or science had proven that my parents didn't love me. So, that's Pog. Um... But you know what? It happens. So we are... Uh, oh, I got that. So what we're going to do here is we're going to go through here. And... Hoo yes! I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. Wait, where's the cube though? Where's the cube? Wait a minute. Did I not push the button? And if I didn't, then where does the cube drop? I should have been paying closer attention. All right. Now we can go. Oh. Ah. Yes, yes. Ah. Waddle over to the elevator and we'll continue the testing. Waddle? What do you mean waddle? That was a pretty fast paced test. If I do say so myself, I just forgot uh, the, the button. Or the box. Not the button. I have my Rubik's Cube, so that's what that chicka chicka sound is. Okay. What do you got next for me, but but dog, bud, dog? No. This next test involves the okay. Avenger Science Aerial Faceplate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were highly informative. They could not. Good luck. Okay. Jump, grab, haha. -ha. Put you down Here's and an we go. Fact. You're not breathing real air. I'm not. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. Oh, cool. You I know what? That was interesting. It is pretty interesting. But you want to know what's more interesting? I don't care. <laughs> I don't know. I love this game. Right now Let's we're we're on the, the test easy is. test. Oh, Pretty soon they get defense. really well, oh. soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up fifteen acres of broken glass by myself. Okay. <laughs> Oopsies. Okay, that was a mistake. Um, I don't remember exactly what we do on this one. Honestly, I don't remember Let's what to do what in most of these tests. Oh, advanced aerial but they're not hard yet. Have fun soaring through when the we, uh... World. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick okay. up 15 acres of broken uh, glass I know, I heard you. by myself. Whee! Okay. Now the tests are gonna get hard real quick. I'm pretty sure there's a way to break that, but I don't remember how. Anyway. Oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them, standing around, smelling and being useless. 
Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. No! Oh, hi. Well, I think I'm stuck. I'm not stuck here now. What do you got for me here? Oh. How do I get... Okay, anyway. Okay. Give it to me. Oh. You don't have to test with the garbage. It's garbage. I got you! Yeah, see. And I got perfect aim every time. Talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless. I was talking was about you. I was actually talking about you. I know. And I'm sorry. You no, didn't you're not. At the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. No, it didn't. You should have made this apology seem insane. <laughs> That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. Yeah. I know. You're not really that sorry about it. I know you're not. So why are you apologizing? Who knows? But it's fine because we're testing and this is what I live for. Guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises. I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting sign. Oh, did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. Sure thing. Oh, no. I fizzled that one too. Oh well. We have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. Yep. Very worthless. Not, not, not worth anything. Anyway, I don't know what I'm doing at this point. Do I want to go like this? Okay, we'll we'll get you there. Then we will there there. And woo! See that easy. Then we follow quickly in, in, in quick pursuit. Get down. Okay, cool. And. And now what we do is we go like this. Shoot. Okay. I mean, right now the companion cube is singing. I don't know if I should be worried about that. I pressed the wrong portal just now. So, um, we get to, so there is a little Easter egg here with this thing. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. Oh, hi. Uh, oh, dang it. I think that one was about to say, I love you. It was. Of course. Of course. We just have a lot of them. 
I mean, I know they're sentient. I mean, last time you said they wouldn't talk to me, but I know they will. I mean, that one was singing. It was so beautiful, but then you just... Anyway... Onwards and upwards to the next t or, or downwards and onwards and downwards to the next chamber or whatever. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. Oh no, the turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. And there, if you have any questions, I think, just remember like, if you're slow that down, it's a uh, no Moby Dick reference, I think. And I'm not sure. Anyway. You know, Moby Dick is pretty decent. I mean, you know... I don't know what I was going to try and say there, aside from it's just decent. Hey, whoa, stop. No, stop. Chill. Chill. Okay. I'll, uh... Hey, it's me. I'm okay. Well, I'm back. The aerial faith plate in here is sending a distress signal. You broke it, didn't you? There. Try it now. I was just lying there. You thought I was mm, This plate must not be calibrated to someone of your generousness. I'll add oh. a few zeros to the maximum weight. Thank you, you dog. Great, by the way, very healthy. Try it now. It worked, right? Couldn't believe it either. <laughs> you seem to have depleted load capacity. Well done. I'll Thank you. Sounds good. Thank you. I don't I didn't really need to hear what he had to say anyway, do I or did I or I don't know. So now what do I do? I honestly have no idea. I mean Okay. Um, I still have no idea what to do. Because that's not a portal. Uh, I can't portal on this. Um. Well. Crap. So we go like that. I can't jump over that. And then we just yeet. I'm shit. Okay, watch this. This is what we do. It's it's genius, right? We put the portal there. Uh, put that there, and yeet. That was on purpose. Then right click there because we put the left click on the other one. Then we go yeet. Yes! Haha! -ha. Then we go like this. Then we go like this. Then we go like that. But firstly, we gotta come right here. And right click there. Fly through the air! Look at you, sailing through the air majestically. Like an eagle, piloting a blimp. Thank you. I do pilot blimps in my free time, you know. And that's that test chamber done. Now I think we're going to end this one here. I guess we've gotten contact from Wheatley again. So that's Pog. Um, yeah. Uh, if you're enjoying the series so far, let me know, like, subscribe, you know, all that good jazz. If you want to see more Valve games, uh, let me know as well, because I'm on a huge binge with them. 
I cannot get enough of them. I love them. Anyway, that's enough of this rambling. We'll end it here. I'll see y'all on the flip side.